Good morning, campers. Welcome to Star Trucker. My name is Elio Deer. I'm a real life truck driver. And I've got the day off, and I've been told I absolutely have to try this game. So let's jump right in. I've played it a little bit so far. I've gone through the demo once already. I have not completed the demo. I just like started playing it and got kind of an idea for how it goes. And uh, it's pretty interesting. So I just wanted to kind of show it off. Right. This is a 1044 in the big rig that just broke down in Onyx. Looks like you're leaking a whole lot of lung juice Space there, suit. buddy. Airlock. You might want to take a walk and patch those holes. Outside. You can space yourself without a spacesuit. You don't die right away, which is interesting. I'm playing this on an Xbox controller. I really, really like the, uh... Spacewalk controls for this game so far. Oops. There's a bunch of stuff on the truck that's like not ideal right now, but we're not going to worry about it. The, but uh, one thing we are going to do is pick up that. Oh, ah, I just ruined this already. Oh, we managed to put that down without damaging it. Is it this one? Yes. Okay, we're going to put these in the hard case so they don't get damaged. If, if we hit anything. Uh, also, I think there's... Yes, there's batteries. Ah! Don't know how that happened. Okay, so that's the important stuff from the shelf put away. Uh, and then what's in this one? Is this more batteries? Uh, air filters. It's honestly surprisingly accurate to what you wind up fixing a lot in... Truck. <laughs> uh, oh, so, badge uh, up. Good. Tutorials. I guess you were heading out with Prime on the job. Uh, cameras. Well, just a quick heads up, but that gate's been real temperamental as of late. Lucky for you, the repair drones are busy fixing it as we speak. I reckon by the time you reach it, they'll have it up and running again. I kind of like having it as the mirror one, so you can keep an eye on the trailer. Yeah, keep an eye on our hull. So we don't actually have to be really careful about the jump gate here this first time. It'll stop us automatically and let us go through. Yeah, we can't hit any of the switches yet. That's fine. Yep, yep, yep. Alright, so that's going to bring in the This is Galactic B calling in from the DIV. Glad to see you finally made it. We've already got a drop zone warmed up and waiting for you. So just head on over to the waypoint, detach your trailer in the designated area, and I'll make sure your payment gets processed ASAP. So now the important thing is not to hit me. <laughs> this game's been running really well until I started trying to record it, but I'm getting a little frame, so I do apologize for that. It's not very smooth. Switch the camera real quick. I don't see anyone else is going to be a huge problem for me. So I 
things we need to fix first. So let's open up all the little power holes. So I think these are core A and core B. If I'm right, so let's just pull one of these. Yeah, okay, so that's core A and core B. So we'll set this on the ground here. I think this was power. Yeah, so that's 200. We'll put that one in here. That there, that's 150. Uh, that one's 200. So we'll put that one there. That one's 69. Nice. 
Boom. Grab the 200. Okay, that one's good. Uh, these are... Uh, I think these are two to the right, mag A and mag B. Yeah, yeah. okay, so these are, these are both fine. So, but grav is kind of low and oxygen is... Well, oxygen's fine, but we can do grav. So grav, took me a while to find this one. Grav is under the stairs. It's this one. So that's at 35. Okay, we got a two. We got another 200. So let's go ahead and just pull that. And there. I don't know how to recharge these. I haven't figured that out yet. Hopefully, there will be a way to do that in the, the actual game. About if there's a way in the demo, uh, beats me. So let's just go ahead and close that. There's one other thing that it's helpful to do first. So do 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 climate control. So, this thing's got really low hit points. I've had this fail on me a couple of times in the game so far. This is the oxygen power cell, by the way, if you need to do that. But this is for climate control. And it's the little circuit breaker thing. This is the suit charger. It uses one of each. Um, but I don't find I need the suit terribly much unless I run into stuff. I do like the quilt texture on the walls. That's a very nice touch. A lot of classic trucks have that. But uh, we've got a couple of those UCC things in this. So we're going to open that hatch there. Uh, where's the circuit breakers? Here? here? Yeah, okay, so climate regulator is off. Now we're going to pull the UCC. Stick the bad one in there, take a good one. And close that, and we're going to turn that circuit breaker back on, all good, and which one of these is bad? And that was the bad one, we're going to put that on the right there, just to kind of remember that that one sucks. Okay, so I don't think we'll have any situations where we need any more of those, I think that'll set us up nicely for the rest of the, uh, rest of this session, we don't have shields or whatever, so let's get ourselves another job. Let's see. Electronic waste. These all pay pretty well. Uh, Atlas Prime to Onyx. I think Onyx, Onyx was where we just were. I haven't figured out why the payouts are so different. So let's do... Instagalactic to purity. Electronic waste rush delivery. 1945? Alright, we can do that. Uh, except. Alright, so. Back into the seat. You can't actually go inside the buildings yet. I don't know if that's going to be a thing later, but... Would be cool. Alright, so. Roof lights. Auxiliary lights, headlights, and then cab lights can go off. We'll get that over to our mirror. That over to docking bay. Open the shutters. Alright, and let's unhitch. Center of that 
circle and reverse.
haven't encountered a situation where I've needed to do that yet. Alright, so we're coming in kind of low. I always forget how much of this truck exists below the, uh, below the line. Alright, Skill point, uh, I just feel like fragile is probably better, just if you're being careful in this game. That sounds like a uh, better way to make money. Did that work? I think that worked. All right, so let's pull it forward. So you can see it's negative 112 outside. So last time I played this, uh, <laughs> last time I played this, I lost my climate controls here and couldn't figure out what to do about that and it froze to death, uh, which is why I went through the, uh, the trouble of swapping out that UCC for does not look like there's fuel here. There's fuel at Atlas Prime, there's fuel at Medusa 6. Okay. So, I think... I don't know what that is. I assume there's more jobs. We'll just go to this one. And then see if we can't get a job here. Back to Atlas. Or, uh, even better, Medu uh, job straight to Medusa 6 would be kind of cool. Oh, there's a the job board. Everything real quick. So again, close the shutters. Don't really need to, but makes me feel better. Uh, you have manuals in here, which I don't know. I think these are circuit breakers, possibly. Uh, haven't needed to do anything with those yet, but that's what I would guess from that. So let's just check on our diagnostics real quick. Oh, can you see the shutters opening on that view? Yeah, that's neat. Close the two little, the two little top windows too. That's nifty. So our oxygen power cell is still pretty. It's getting 50%. That's the only one we really need to worry about. How's the hull doing? Hull's still good. We haven't hit anything. So exit the seat. Cabin's still relatively well organized because we haven't been whipping all over the place. What do we got on the job board? There we go. See, we got ourselves a fragile cargo that only pays 300. That's disappointing. Where's that purity to 
See, this one's purity to Medusa 6, but it's only 600, and this one's 1,000. And this one only goes to Atlas Prime. Hmm. Fascinating. I guess we do that one. Can you sleep in this game? don't think there's anything else I need to do while we're parking. Does this open? Oh, it does open. What is this? What is this? This looks important. What am I supposed to have here? Uh... Is that these? Huh? No? Okay, well... Worth a try. Where, does he, where are the air filters supposed to go? Because I haven't figured that one out yet. You know what? If I had to guess, I would say the air filters probably go in these? Yeah! There we go, okay. Neat! 312, 311, 311, okay. We're good on air filters, so that's cool. I was gonna say they might, uh, they might be... It might be in the stacks outside here, but I'm guessing there's no, like, external... Oh, yeah, there, there's some external air cleaners there. But, you know, we're not really sucking in air from outside because we're in space, so... Probably not a good way to do that. Let's get those lights off. I don't know if this helps save power or not. I feel like it should, but I don't know how useful that would be. So this is roof lights. Yeah, that's our clearance lights. This is our auxiliary lights. Don't know what the auxiliary lights are. Hmm. Headlights. Okay, well, I don't know what the auxiliary lights are, but... Probably fine. Unhitch. that's a modern thing in every space game now, but when I was a kid you didn't see the joysticks move in, in, in the spaceships in your video games. That wasn't really a thing. So it, it still tickles me. Uh, it still tickles me every time.
interesting. I don't think I've ever gone this way before. So there's the, the way we came in, it's dead ahead. It looks like the departure gate is on the right. That's interesting.
all that money. I have no idea how much money I have. But we're apparently early. Oh, before, do I get another skill point for that? Apparently not. That's fine. Alright, so we'll get down here. Too bad to fill up the fuel tank. Are we good now? Yeah, we're good. That's still good. How am I on all this stuff? Oxygen's still getting low. Everything else is in pretty good shape. Oh, are these? Oh, I bet these are the air filters. The efficiency things. That's fun. That is, that's forward. Is there one of those that goes back? Oh, I guess the docking camera, yeah. Great. There's that mirror. So first out of the fuel pump. Oh, that's true. <laughs> that's amazing. But I just saw the fuel sign there. That's... They, they fucking nailed the, uh... They nailed the aesthetic. That's pretty good. Let's go check out the, uh... Paint shop. Let's see how much customization you have. Is that how much money I have, or how much it's going to cost to paint the truck? Ooh, fancy. See how we've got Space Peter built going. The radiator seems unnecessary, but sure, why not? Um, hmm. Hmm. Let's see, so the company, we're pretty close to having the paint scheme of the truck that I drive right now, so let's just, ooh, we've got different, okay, uh, ooh, that's fancy, yeah, let's go with that. <laughs> Can I change the colors? No. Bummer. 
Oh, we got gloss. Okay, so industrial matte gloss metallic. It's a space Peterbilt, so I feel like metallic is kind of what we got to go for here, and that's what we've already got. So, yeah, I think that's I think that's pretty good. <laughs> got our fancy paint job. There we go. That's our reward for doing two jobs for the uh, that place right outside. Is that it? Cool. So we still got the patch on the nose. I don't know how to get rid of that patch on the nose that you have to put on right off the bat. Okay, what was the other thing I wanted to... I wanted to see what the... What's that do? Oh, interesting. Okay, okay, so that's your two separate thrusters. Fascinating. Right, so I wanted to see what salvage. So, oh, they've all got names! That's cool! Is there any salvage nearby? got some more jobs. Oh, do I do have money in the uh, top right corner of the screen. That's fun. Uh, that goes to Purity. That pays 1,000. That goes to Medusa 6. We haven't been to Medusa 6 yet. So yeah, I kind of want to do that. Yeah, let's, let's do that. Where's that pickup? West Coast Galaxy? Pretend I know where that is. Sign the contract without reading it. That's extremely accurate to the industry. If you actually like want to read the uh, the contracts involved in the carriage, people treat you like you're just utterly bizarre. They'll have me. They'll have me get like four pages of reading.
lot of those contracts will say that it'll be like a shipper load driver count and it'll be a place that told me to stay in the truck. I'm like, okay, well that's not correct. So you gotta make sure you put on there that the shipper load and counted it. Uh, some places will get mad at you for doing that. It's like, well, you told me to wait in the truck. I couldn't count the load from inside the truck, so if you want, you can take everything off the truck and I can count it and then you can put it back on. And most places are willing to let you sign a shipper load count instead of doing that. Yeah, the arrows are pointed towards me, so I might be coming in on this 
doesn't matter. That's fun. Success. Careful driving bonus. Hey, there we go. I think I just beat the demo. 10-10 <laughs> till we do it again. All right. That's cool. That's that's a lovely little game. I, I hope y'all check it out. Uh, you can run through the demo in about an hour if you play carefully and stuff. Uh, it's 55 minutes here for us today. Um, but you can also just not do jobs and just like tool around the different systems and check them out. It's uh, pretty sweet. Yeah, so um, if you don't really want to worry about the system failures and stuff, you can do the stuff that I did when we docked that first time to just get ahead of that. Or you can just play until the stuff breaks and then it's a little more exciting, I guess. <laughs> I don't know. It's certainly uh, more terrifying if you do it that way, but that was actually a remarkably successful and boring run through of that, which is how I like it, my trucking job. So apologies for burping right into the microphone here at the end, but thank you guys so much for watching. My name is Elio Dare. You can find me on the internet on Twitter at Elio Dare, Xbox Live, Steam, Nintendo Switch, etc. If you want to play games with me when I'm home um, and you know, I uh, don't really do much videos these anymore, but this one seemed special, so I wanted to check it out. So yeah, go play this. It's fun. Buy it when it comes out. I'll be on it. Hopefully they'll have co-op of some kind. And uh, yeah, thank you so much for watching, and have a great day.